subconscious totally takes over when you're painting, especially when you get in the zone and <laughs> three hours later and you look back, you're like, what just happened? <laughs> Okay, I'll do it, I'll go for it. Um, well, I've been doing art ever since I was born. I mean, I just, well, all little kids are artists, but I just continued doing it, and my family always knew that I was going to be an artist. I grew up in a really rural, tiny town in Oregon where there wasn't a lot of art opportunities. There was, there were paintings of elk, and that was kind of like the norm, the landscapes, and so I was like the crazy liberal artist girl who was doing stuff with weird colors and all this. I'm really drawn to light. If anything was to inspire me more than anything else, it's like light on things and how color is affected. I really love like everything that life has to offer. I know I, I like to pick snippets out of everything and I love to constantly be learning. And I think that that's really important as far as being an artist as well, is that you need to know what life is to be able to paint life. Or that's for me personally. The feel, the tactile, just the energy that from an oil painting. The paint itself is so fantastic. The pigment has just this viscosity and it has, each different pigment has its own properties. And so like the Science Maggie is like, ooh, this one has, you know, this degree of translucency and this one is this. And so it's like I get to connect to my inner nerd that way too. There's so much more to oil painting than people actually know, or just art in general. Like there's just such a depth to it and understanding and once you scrape the surface you're just hooked and you have to keep going. My paintings seem to have a more serious mood as far as the portraits go. There's not a lot of people smiling, which isn't necessarily intentional, it just happens that way, but I think that my more bright active self comes through in the colors. So it's, it's kind of a fun balance. I like to look at a painting after I'm finished and look at it and I kind of wonder, like, it's so bright, where did all that color come from? But... You can't really do anything wrong with art. There's no right or wrong way, and I really love that. I think that it's, um, it gets kind of shoved to the side sometimes, but I think it's really important as far as, like, physical, spiritual, emotional well-being for people in general. And I mean, I know that art helped me get through my parents' divorce when I was younger. I did a lot of angry Maggie drawings, and it was great because I would come out of a drawing feeling fantastic. And so.